guys welcome to this video and today we're going to be talking about the flash season 5 we're going to be breaking down the new leaks from the flash set for episode 18 titled and we'll talk about that very soon so if you do go on to enjoy the video please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any dc tv videos later this year so yes episode 18 i didn't put in the title because oh my god so the official title it was found out by canada graphs you can check them out in the description below check out their blog and also check out there's loads of photos on there from the set from i believe it was yesterday actually and the title is officially titled godspeed i'm not even lying godspeed's finally coming they're finally going to be tackling him i don't know in what capacity but that's what we're going to be talking about in this video and so that's a massive reveal so he was able to actually spot the title on one of like the calling cards or the scripts or something like that it says episode 18 godspeed and so who is godspeed well in the comics godspeed is a relatively new character and he is august heart he actually works with barry he's a csi and he was recently introduced in dc rebirth so when the flash had its rebirth and barry was back barry's the flash he actually worked with Barry Allen inside the CCPD and so essentially that's where their sort of link started in the comics and when it goes on you get to see that he's just kind of normal he wants to do things that you know the Flash wouldn't do and so he takes it upon himself to essentially be a hero in his own mind so I guess similar to like maybe Deadpool how he thinks oh killing all these people is going to be good and it's going to be for the better and so that's what he does so when he's hit by the speed force storm it creates loads of metas creates loads of new speedsters and august Hart gets hit by it and in the comics he's like one of the strongest speedsters actually he's able to duplicate himself and be in two places at once and as he says in the comics he's judge jury and executioner that's why he calls himself godspeed and so the title of this episode is godspeed so there if they follow the comic book origins we are going to be seeing august heart and the question i want to pose is will we see godspeed in his suit in this episode i don't believe so i think there's a slim possibility that it may do that but i think for now what we're probably going to see is maybe a teaser because this episode and we'll talk about this in a sec is going to be mainly set in 2049 and I think it's very fitting with what we're about to talk about in terms of leaks of what's happening in the episode that Danielle Panabaker is directing it because she's been around since the very start. And so this is some loose spoilers from Canada Graphs and we're going to read this out. This was updated last night. There was a night scene as well. And so we'll talk about the other stuff in a sec. In the night scene, Grant Gustin and Jessica Parker Kennedy did a scene together. So that's Nora and Barry in the year 2049 and we know this by the way from the photos if you check out his blog you get to see that one of the license plates says 2049 on it and there's a futuristic car we'll talk about the photos in a sec they're doing a scene together in the year 2049 and things are getting pretty intense according to canada graphs and he says part of the dialogue that was explained and set out from the characters was dad you don't have to do this. I promise I'll never see Thorn again. So by episode 18, the secret is out. What is happening? That is crazy. So the title of the episode is Godspeed and we're getting Barry and Nora time traveling to 2049. Barry's about to do something and it's most likely something to do with Thorn. Probably he's going to try and kill Thorn. So somehow he's found out by now. Maybe Sherlock reveals it. But the reveal and the sort of secret has been revealed by episode 18, which is crazy. And so Barry is going to not see Nora the same way, as in, she says, I promise I'll never see Thorn again. So he definitely knows. But why is he there in the future? Like 2049, we see in the photos that the police cars in ccpd like working for the ccpd sorry are actually very futuristic they're kind of small compact and it says electric fleet police the like i said the number plate has 2049 and on the number plate it says forever free and so it's just a little nice rebranding but that's to signify that this is 2049 they're in the future i know there's a some sort of bank robbery scene in this episode barry is somehow there with nora in the future so they've 100% time traveled Barry's going to do something 
and we don't know what yet but in some of the photos you see Barry and Nora together as they're doing this scene as Barry is in the future about to do something that Nora doesn't want to do in regards to reverse flash and so that's extremely exciting to talk about so earlier on in the day let's just go back and talk about some of these other scenes that was shot um daniel panabaker was obviously directed jessica parker kennedy's stunt double was actually flung onto a car in this episode so i believe this is probably going to be you know maybe the meta of the week or something like that or perhaps it is godspeed you know via him running past and it's just a few glimpses maybe this is the new villain that is introduced in 2049 that they have to deal with like has Nora never heard of Godspeed? Is it a totally new villain? And will next season be featured in the future? Or will Godspeed come to the past? That would be extremely exciting if August Hart actually is present in CCPD in the episode, but in the future. And then he somehow comes to the past, and then he's the villain next season. Or maybe he actually takes over Cicada this season, which I think is highly unlikely, but I think there is a chance that that could happen i would love to see it so i'm very excited because i'm a big fan of godspeed and everyone's been questioning you know since season four it's like when the think was announced everyone was like come on who's gonna be the villain is either gonna be godspeed or cobalt blue never happened season five same thing we we're like okay godspeed or cobalt blue never happened but now we've got a title of an episode called godspeed is he finally coming? I think he is. And so it could be like a trajectory type episode where it only, where Godspeed only appears for one episode. But I have a feeling it's going to be something longer. And I don't think they would just, you know, have such a big comic book character recently that there are so many fans of and just kind of throw it away for one episode like trajectory. So I believe they'll be setting something up. And so in regards to the other scenes they shot, the cops are chasing someone and kind of graphs not sure who it is so that could be august thought that could be godspeed but i reckon it's probably just like a meta of the episode in the future that they have to defeat and so after the scene ended the crew actually went to like an undisclosed location underground and they shot some more scenes so that's essentially what he was able to see kind of was able to see but the official title was godspeed so let me know in the comments down below what do you think about this are you very excited because are you a massive godspeed fan i know some people are like ah oh, you know it's just been too long everyone wants him he's sort of like a i guess you could say a meme some people could view it like that i think Paige does i would really like to see it because i'm really missing the speech of villains and i think it's about high time we see one again because again the reverse flash obviously is back but there's not been like a main speedster villain since season three and i think that is sort of a big absence and if it was like a sort of mystery maybe they twist it on the comics maybe they don't use august heart maybe it's someone we already know and similar to like cicada maybe the identity changes or it's like a kind of secret like zoom and how at one point you think oh it could be this person this person but it was actually the jay garrick imposter Hunter Zolomon so I think something like that would be really interesting if they keep it like a secret and they keep him sort of masked up and maybe it's someone we don't expect maybe it's not August Hart but maybe August Hart does exist in the future I think that's a pretty good theory so that is about it so just quickly going over you know to do with Godspeed a tiny bit before we end this video so August like I said he's a good guy but he's more of an anti-hero he sees himself as but he brutally murders all his victims and he thinks he's doing the work that Flash doesn't do. And so he's just sort of given up on the justice system, deciding to become judge, jury and executioner, like I said earlier, killing murderers, killing all these villains and criminals and Barry and Mina, who actually dies and then she comes back, but read the comic, actually try and stop him in the comics. And I think if they do this, I think either they could say oh he's already created or he gets created in the future because they're in the future in this episode so i think there's a lot of different ways they can bring him in but i believe he's going to come so anyway guys what do you think about this awesome news let me know in the comments down below and i will see you guys later goodbye